And now, ladies and gentlemen, I bring you Sam's stories for this week. Take it away, Sam. Thank you, George. Well, we've had a mix-up on Sunday with the Spurs fans, confusing Chris Hoy with Chris Foy. Chris Hoy had to say, well, he's a bit surprised when he got all this abuse from the Spurs fans. He said about this, I'm getting some rather amusing grief from Spurs fans. Just for the record, one, I don't need glasses, and two, I do not lead a double life as a ref. That's Chris Foy. <laughs> and, yeah, it's, and he's saying, um, oh, it's amazing, if you search for Chris Foy, you can see so many four of words <laughs> you, you wouldn't be able to say on here, but, um, yeah, <laughs> pretty bad. And also the sad news that Johnny Wilkinson has retired from international rugby. Such a legend. Yeah. And also, yeah, we... Too right. Yeah, remember him for that famous drop kick goal in the 2003 World Cup final against Australia the old enemy and I mean, if, if I could, <laughs> James got something to say yeah, I mean if I could just very make, briefly make um, a quick point with regards to the referee of the Spurs game I mean, it wasn't actually Chris Hoy it was actually someone called George Baines <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to no no, no obviously it wasn't George but George Baines is the DJ of this show please do not email any abuse to George Baines oh so I, he did I, yeah. I, exactly I know but <laughs> who's going to work out what was going on there's no point thanks for that James um, yeah. <laughs> No, you obviously don't email George. But if you do have any questions, please do um, feel free to. Yeah, email. I think someone's gonna. Yeah, someone's bound to message now. Mm. Surely. I need to I, check I the really email. Hope someone does. We, we should yeah. check our email. Yeah, go on. We will do. Um, is that all for Sam's stories this week? Well, I suppose we, um, we can mention um, going for that dinner on Sunday. Yeah, if you've got <laughs> anything to say from that. Um, back yeah, because yeah, um, yeah, it's like we were going for um, yeah, a meal. We, we wanted to go to a Chinese place, but that was too full, so we went to Harvest instead. She turned out to be much better, because we seemed to be pretty full from the free salad than the actual food itself. They basically had like chicken wings and yeah, me and you me and George were the only ones who had the ice cream as well why isn't everyone else just sitting there looking at us mm. judging us you felt um, really I pissed. did have to admit I did feel a bit guilty eating a honeycomb sundae oh, it was yeah. on Saturday in the Harvested have oh, you been to so the Harvester good. before James I have to say it's an amazing place to eat have you been there um, I don't think so Wait, where's the Harvester it's in the brewery in town yeah, you, you may not have seen it here it's but, new, um, yeah. no I don't I don't think I have no <laughs> yeah, let's check it out but it's an amazing place and you didn't even realise that there was a salad bar before we started yeah, eating salad, so um, yeah I, I don't think I've really had salad either no. <laughs> this might be two new experiences over the course of the next couple of days <laughs> a healthy one maybe yeah. if we go there yeah <laughs> that'd be awesome um, there. coming up now it's a bit of Deacon Blue um, and Sam will tell, tell, tell be trying to big up his TV crew later to get them to go on this social tomorrow night in which oh, yeah. James Bickerton here will be joining us oh yes that's what we think anyway I, I, am I online now? Um, you, you're not online, no. Um, <laughs> no, no, I am. Yeah, people can hear you. Um, I, I, I...